Hey guys, it's W from Cat Media coming back to you with another video, another tutorial, this time on an application called Foulbot. So if you're like we are, and you have all kinds of different movies, so this kind of goes back to the series that I posted um, on how to rip DVDs and Blu-rays. And once you get all of those files ripped and moved into a folder, they're going to be in a naming convention that if you're trying to use Plex, it's not going to see it. So you got to rename them. So Filebot it is an application that's going to help you do that, and it's going to do it for you so that you don't have to sit there and spend all that time manually trying to update those file names. Stay with me, and I'll show you how to do it. Thanks for sticking with me. All right, so let's get started on the project. First thing we want to do, pull up files. We're going to be renaming some Big Bang Theory Season 5. And as I said, when you start looking at these, it really doesn't give you much information. And what we want to do is we want to change the names here to match Season 5 Disc 2. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to turn up Filebot. So I already have Filebot up, so we'll just go ahead and click that. We're going to bring this over here. Now this is really, really easy. Oh, and by the way, Filebot, it is not a free program. It's about six dollars so let me open this up yes so filebot www.filebot.net um, it's it's amazing and it's relatively cheap easy to download doesn't take that much space i'm going to put a link to this website in the description to make it easier for you so now that we have this up really this is the way i do it there's a couple different ways you can grab the file, upload everything, and then try to do a match. Uh, but then normally you have to match everything up. So this is the way I do it. So first I'm going to come over here and do episodes. And this is on season five. And we're going to say the Big Bang Theory. It finds it. Click on that. And we'll click find. So here you go. It's going to give you a couple different options. We want the first one. We'll click select. And now it's given us everything that we need. So on this particular, it's uh, eight episodes. So we are going to go and we're going to uh, go back to the rename file, click on load, and we're going to click on folder. Now you want to stay at the very top. You don't want to go into where it's going to show each of the files. Because what Filebot is going to do when you click on this, and we're going to, I put them into the rename folder. Normally when you do a full series, you just load them all up into the existing season that you're trying to work on and then you can do all this all at the same time um, in this case i'm going to click rename and there's the five now i'm going to come over to episodes and i'm going to click on the episodes that i need so that's 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 those are the ones that i need I'm going to right click and I'm going to say send to rename already there. See that? Now, I left this folder up so you could see this. This is pretty cool. Favorite part. When you click on rename, it automatically renamed all those files all for you and it cleared up for the next. So really, all we need to do now is do a Cut and copy, put these all in here, Gonna paste them in, and now we have the remainder of the full season. And if you have them in this, it's automatically going to register on your Plex server. Um, it does give you the option over here in Filebot, if, uh, if you need to change them for any reason, you can override the format down here and edit format and it gives you the different file names that you can do. For us, this is the one that we wanted to pick. This is the one I have for set for default. And you simply click use. But that's it. That's as simple as it gets. It makes it so much easier. You don't have to sit there and manually type it. Um, again, this software, Filebot, is very inexpensive. It's worth it. Uh, it. You get a year subscription for, again, it's like six or $7. I'll leave a link down in the description for you if you're interested. If you're doing this type of work, it's something you should really consider. Be sure to smash our like button and subscribe to our channel.
it's a little thing for you but a big thing for us just go ahead and click on that and also you might want to click on the bell uh, that way you'll get notifications the next time we do more uploads YouTube will let you know make it 10 times easier to get some great content from Needy Cat Media as always thanks for watching stay safe and stay healthy take care